and I'm an application specialist in Biovitrum company. Welcome on our YouTube channel, where we discuss histological process, its basics, some interesting facts and some tricks and tips to make it easier. Do you know what protein makes up to 35% of the whole body protein content? It is collagen, the main structural protein in various connective tissues. It is an important component of bones, tendons, cartilages, skin and blood vessels. Thus, it is very important to visualize collagen for studying pathological processes in these structures. Do you know how to identify collagen in tissues? There are several special stains which allow us to do this. And today we will discuss the most common histological method of differential staining of collagen in connective tissues, vangison staining. This method was introduced to histology by American neuropsychiatrist and pathologist Ira Van Gison in 1889. Ira Van Gison was born in Long Island in 1866. He graduated from the College of Physicians of Columbia University and in 1896 he was appointed as the first director of Pathological College of the New York State Hospital for the Insane. He died quite young at the age of 47. He was an author of many scientific and medical articles, especially about nervous system. And still his name is known all over the world because of the staining method that he developed. The main components in Van Gison method are picric acid and acid foxin. Picric acid or trinitrophenol, as many other nitrated organic compounds, is an explosive and it was once its primary use but it has also many other uses, for example in medicine as antiseptic and treatment for burns. Buen solution, which is a common fixative used in histology, also contains picric acid. Acid fuchsin is an acetic magenta dye and it has also many uses in histology. On the first step of Van Gison method, we use Weigert's iron hematoxylin, which is a mixture of solutions A and B and should be prepared right before staining. It forms polarized complex which bites with nuclei, stain it in black color and is stable in acid environment. The working solution is Van Gison picrofoxin. Picric acid stains all structures not selectively in yellow. Fuxin in acid environment binds only with collagen and stains it in red color as a result. Collagen stains strongly with acid dyes due to the affinity of cationic groups of proteins to anionic reactive groups of acid dyes. What is important to pay attention on in this method? Tissue should be fixed in neutral buffet formalin. Washing in water after one gizon solution should be avoided. The color balance is impaired by this. Nuclear staining should be intensive before application of vangison solution and the picric acid will act as a differentiator. We will continue talking about other special stains in histology for different tissues in our next videos. If this video was useful for you, press like. If you have any questions or something to add, write in comments. Subscribe not to miss our new videos. Thank you. See you soon.